Now it's time to do the lovely Miss Boo. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> What is going on, Pompon Gang? Welcome back to the Pompon Sisters YouTube channel. My name is Shantae, and it has been a minute since I have posted on YouTube. I think I took about a month, month and a half off of posting any videos. Well, of course, we are back again, and like we never left. So I kind of had to take a break to kind of get myself together and work on other things around the house as well. My anxiety was through the roof and was starting to show its rear ugly head, and I definitely know my trigger point points and went to you know kind of change my routine up and trying to focus on myself a little bit more so I took a small break but we are back like we never left and we are here with a hair tutorial using the pretty strands um, hair products and of course this is my youngest baby girl Callista Miss Boo is what we call her and she will be at three soon um, so here we're just doing her regular hair routine um, and I'm going in with the shampoo and conditioner. I first reviewed these products on my oldest daughter, Kalia, which these products work amazing. So I was kind of curious to see how it would work on my other two girls because Kalia has really, really curly hair aside from her younger sisters who their hair is curly, but it has some mixtures of waves and Lonnie definitely has a nice pretty body wave for her natural curl. So I kind of wanted to see what these products would do and I cannot complain. They are definitely products for all curly hair types. Now for Boo's hair, we go, we're going in with a quick shampoo and a quick conditioning. Her hair is very thin. She still has that very thin baby toddler hair. So it doesn't take much to do her hair. Once I go in with her shampooing and conditioning, I'm now going to detangle with the conditioner still in her hair. The Pretty Strand conditioner is very, very, very thick. I love how thick it is. It really provides a lot of slip when it is time to detangle their hair. And I just go in with a detangling brush. Sometimes I go in with a wide tooth comb for um, Boo's hair, depending on how tangled her hair is. If it's really, really tangled, I'll go in with a wide tooth. If it's something simple that I know I can get out really quickly, I'll just go in with her detangling brush. With her hair being so fine and so thin, I try to take very care of detangling her hair because I don't want to thin her hair any more than what it is. I believe she's going to have natural thin hair. I don't think she's going to have that thick, luscious hair like Kalia and Lonnie does, which is perfectly fine. Um, but I know to be very careful with her hair because I don't want to make cause extra breakage to her hair, which is already thin. So once it, we are done detangling, we're going to go ahead and rinse this all out on cool water and we will begin styling. Now, this is her hair. I let her run around the house uh, for a couple of minutes. It does not take long for her hair to air dry with it being so thin. So this is her hair air dried, and I kind of wanted y'all to get a close-up look on her curl texture. So her hair has grown a lot. Um, I have not trimmed her hair, like, ever. This is, like, Boo's hair from birth. So Boo will have the thinnest hair. Kalia has the curliest hair, and Lonnie has the thickest hair for my three girls so for styling boo's hair i 
try to do minimal styles. She is a toddler, so hairstyles definitely don't last long. So I try not to do over the top hairstyles like I do on Kalia, who knows how to kind of take care of her braids or her hairstyles a little bit longer. I don't have to worry about her going to daycare and coming back and missing two, three ponytails like Boo. So um, I try to just stick to simple ponytail looks or, or simple braid looks. Sometimes I'll add colorful rubber bands as an accessory or hair bows, but we try to keep it very minimal and very simple and very quick and easy because she does not sit still for long when it comes to doing her hair. So I'm going in using the Pretty Strands Leave-In Conditioner Spray. This is going to help with detangling. Her hair is not tangled. Um, this is just going to help with softening, it, softening her hair as I go in to part it. And we're just gonna go in with two uh, ponytails today. We'll do like a side one and then one in the back. I love the her, her curls, how they curl on the end. So I usually don't braid up her ends. I kind of let those curls kind of just fly and flow, but we make sure they're moisturized because her hair does dry out very, very easily. So I do take care and put in moisture on her hair. Not as heavy as I do with Kalia's because Kalia does experience a lot of frizz if her hair is not moisturized properly. Boo can kind of get away with, you know, maybe, a, a dime size amount for moisture products when it comes to styling Boo's hair. I try not to use too much gel on Boo's hair with her hair being thin. Um, I try not to apply too much product that's going to cause gunkiness and product buildup. I try to keep her scalp nice and clean and free from any kind of gunkiness or anything like that. That's going to help with her hair growth, especially with her being young. I want to go ahead and promote her scalp to have that healthy hair growth and um, be free from dirt and debris so i probably wash boo's hair maybe twice a week sometimes i can get away with maybe once every two weeks it just depends on boo's activity at daycare and her activity at home if she's very active it requires it, of course i will have to push up her wash day so um just another simple look for boo once we are done i'm then going to go in with the pretty strands hair oil i use this hair oil on everyone i absolutely love this hair oil this is my favorite product out of the entire line of the pretty strands i love all the products but my favorite my number one favorite is definitely this hair oil it's thick but it's light and i probably apply it once i only apply it once until their next hair day uh, or wash day and the oil leaves their scalp so moisturized and it, it just oh i love it i absolutely love it it has a lot of hard hitting um oils combined into this one bottle that provides so much like benefits to the girl's hair their hair isn't dry isn't brittle i love it so i'll even take some and put them on my put it on my hand and rub it into her curls just to add extra shine to her curls but this is it this is it for boo's hair another quick and easy look um thank you guys for joining us and welcome back <laughs> i'm sorry i kind of dipped out on you guys for a couple of weeks but of course we are back again and we will see y'all on our next video please stay safe stay home if you can and y'all have a wonderful and prosperous week